Are you still manually keyframing speedruns in DaVinci Resolve? Bro, stop! That's insane! In this video, I will show you a tool that literally speedruns for you, delivering instant cinematic results in seconds with zero keyframes. This tool won't just save you hours of boring repetitive editing, it creates buttery smooth speedruns effortlessly and actually makes speedramping fun. And no, I'm not talking about the new Resolve 20 Curve Editor, Fusion's tricky time stretcher node, or the old Retime Curves method. Those methods are outdated, annoying, and a complete waste of time. Today, I'm revealing the completely new way editors are achieving this. A tool that's already helped over 100 professionals cut their speed ramping time by 90%. And now, I want to share it with you. Watch till the end because this will fundamentally change how you edit. Let's be honest. How much time have you wasted on manually keyframing speed ramps in DaVinci Resolve? Hours? Days? Or should I better say nights? But I can relate, because the built-in tools in DaVinci Resolve are a nightmare. For example, the Retime Curves method. Everybody knows, it's buggy, it's confusing, the controls are clunky, it just feels like fighting your software. And the results are often unsatisfying too. So, you try Fusion Time Searcher, right? Seems promising. But soon you get tired of what I call the ping pong effect constantly switching between pages just to check if the speedrun fits. It's like doing cardio with your mouse button. But then... DaVinci Resolve 20 Beta. Excitement hits, because with DaVinci Resolve 20 Beta drops the new curve editor on the edit page. Finally, fusion-like curves in the edit page. No more ping-ponging, right? Wrong. As soon as you actually use it for speedramping, you find it's still based on speed steps, not smooth continuous speed curves. They start and end flat, which makes smooth speed ramps impossible. Because hear me out, the key to smooth, eye-pleasing speed ramps is having constantly changing speeds without flat, straight sections. This is simply impossible to achieve with this tool. But here's the worst part. The problem that sabotages your entire edit. Adjusting speed with these built-in methods changes the length of your clip on the timeline. It messes up your timing, breaks audio, it trashes your carefully placed neighboring clips and transitions. It feels like Resolve is literally working against you. All that frustration, all that wasted time, just for one single speed ramp? And you have to repeat that painful process for every single clip in your fucking project. It's repetitive, robotic, it's slave work. Just to achieve a basic speedrun, you're probably thinking, there has to be a better way. Luckily, you found this channel. Because I'm here to fix these everyday problems for editors like you. If you want more solutions to make your editing faster, easier and more fun, make sure to subscribe right now. And now, let me introduce the Speedram plugin V2 for DaVinci Resolve. This plugin does the speed ramping for you. You simply drag the plugin onto your clip and you have an instant professional looking speed ramp. Done! No keyframes, no curves, no frustration. Want different looks? You have a library of 12 built-in professionally designed speedrun presets. Perfect for car edits, real estate tours, sports highlights, music videos, game montages, lifestyle content, whatever you edit. One click and you get a beautiful, buttery smooth speedrun. No setup, zero keyframes. This is the new way. But you're not limited to presets. One full control? Our built-in curve editor makes custom speed ramps a breeze. Unlike the frustrating curve editors you used before, this one makes it easy. Add points and they get automatically smooth. Get complete flexible, individually adjustable handles for fine-tuning. Zoom in and out for incredible precise control when you need it. But the biggest game changer? When you adjust the speed curve with this plugin, your clip stays the exact same length on your timeline. 
it doesn't shorten, it doesn't stretch, your audio stays in sync, neighboring clips remain in place and your carefully placed transitions stay perfect. You can fine tune your speed ramp without destroying the rest of your edit. This is a huge time saver. Let's put this to the test. Look at how long it takes to speed wrap one clip with the old methods. It's a painful process. Now watch with the speed ramp plugin V2. Done. Three seconds. You're wasting hours on something that should take seconds. Think logically. You could speed ramp 20 clips in one minute with this plugin. Bro, this plugin isn't just a tool, it's literally a time machine. You're not just saving time, you're getting hours of your life back if you use this. And all of this isn't just theory. Version 1 was already trusted and loved by over 100 editors, just like you. And version 2 is even more powerful and more refined, based directly on user feedback. You now have the opportunity to join the editors who have unlocked this unfair advantage. Speed ramping 90% faster means you can finish projects quicker, take on more clients, improve your workflow dramatically, and create edits with that buttery smooth professional flow you see in the best car videos, real estate tours and lifestyle content. It's not only an investment in your hobby or your business, it's an investment in your life. But act fast, because you can get version 2 at the price of version 1, which is an absolute steal. But this deal won't last long. Of course, the price will increase soon. But if you want to get your editing hours back, eliminate speed ramping frustrations and make editing fun again, click the first link in the description right now. Get the Speedrun plugin V2 at the lowest price it will ever be and start creating stunning edits today. This speed ramping plugin is just one of the tools in your arsenal to become the GOAT editor. If you want to master transitions just as easily, check out my number one tool for transitions right here or through the link in the description.